Hi guys, I am so happy to do this video. I asked in my last video if you wanted to see the items that I've purchased from Amazon and I saw a couple comments saying yes, please do an Amazon haul. So that is what I'm gonna do today. This is over the course of probably like the last year. I've always been like on the eBay side, but now I'm very much into Amazon. And eBay is great too because you find a lot of unique things. Um, but Amazon Prime is wonderful. Um, I'm not affiliated in any way with Amazon, so I'm just going to give you the tips on why I use Amazon and how it's going to come into play for me, especially for holiday shopping, because I do not like to be out in big crowds. I maybe go like once or twice, like I mentioned in my last video, to kind of make a day of it. But otherwise, I can't be in a lot of crowds. And then I feel like when I am, I'm just buying picked over items, and I don't like doing that. I want to buy things that I have a specific need or I know it's something that I want. And I feel like you have a lot of control that way with online shopping. So before I get started, I wanna tell you that Ebates, if you're gonna shop online, especially Amazon, because Amazon is one of the stores on Ebates and you get a certain percentage off. So make sure that you're signed up. It is cash back to you. You don't pay anything for Ebates. I think that I've gotten back, I think in this last year, like over $200 just from all the online shopping that I do. It's essentially like going into your store like Amazon and getting a percentage of that back to you in cash form. Um, Ebates pays out quarterly, I believe. So um, just know that you won't get your cash until that quarter hits and then they can either mail you a check or they can direct deposit it. I think that's what I have. I have it direct deposited to my PayPal account. So it's super secure. I've been using it for a while and Ebates is amazing. So if you're not signed up, there's a link below for you to sign up. So before you head over to Amazon or any website, check on Ebates and see if they're a participant to getting cash back. And then you have to click um, shop now from Ebates and then it will create this ticket and it takes you straight to the website, whether it's Amazon, Forever 21, Lulu's, it doesn't matter. Um, it will take you straight there. Tons of other great stores, Walmart, Target, so go check it out, it's amazing. All right, so now that we have that covered, I have my iPad here, and I'm gonna look at some of my orders because I'm not gonna be able to show everything because some of them are like bigger items, but I'll probably include like video footage of them and how they're used in my house. And as per usual, <laughs> every time I start filming a video, my dog decides that's when she wants to eat. So if you hear her chomping in the background, that's what it is. And I actually have one package that just came today, so I'll kind of do like a little unboxing. It's not that big of a deal. But everything I do buy on Amazon, I'm very strategic. I always look somewhere else to see if it's a better deal. And nine out of 10 times, Amazon is the better deal. Plus having Prime, you get to return it easily. It ships, You in some cases you get it the very next day. Some cases you get it the same day for free. Amazon Prime, I think, is like $99 membership, and honestly, that's a steal because if I had to pay for shipping for everything that I've gotten, I have spent way more than $99 in shipping. So it's amazing. I love it. I'll always be a Prime member now, and you also get movies, too, for free. You get And, and there they have some movies that's like not on Netflix, so that's another plus. So the very first thing... Um, that I'm not gonna show, but I'll tell you what I got. It is a dog crate. For whatever reason, I ended up just like getting rid of it. And now we need it again because I'm leaving the house a lot. And she, first start, for starters, my dog loves her crate. She's always loved her crate since she was little. And she only goes there like when I need to leave the house. Um, but otherwise she roams and sleeps with me and all those things. Anyway, this crate was $67. I got it on Prime, obviously, and that is pretty cheap. They are, for an extra large for her breed, those crates are not cheap, especially at like a pet store. Um, so I feel like I got an amazing deal and it is extra large so she can walk in, she stands up full, she doesn't crouch down, she can actually turn and move herself. And everything that I'm telling you, I'll link down below separately in case you want that specific item for yourself. 
All right, the next item is a Christmas tree and red car throw pillow cover. So essentially this was $8.99 and this is what I received. It is like a burlap, how gorgeous is this? And it's just the cover, so I'll have to add a pillow, which is great because any pillow will kind of do, or you can always go to Walmart or a craft store and pick up like the pillow and they sell them for very, very cheap. Uh, I would just advise if you do that, that you take your cover with you so that you get the right size. Or you can obviously take the dimensions with you, but this thing, I don't have it yet because it hasn't arrived, but it is the, it is a crew style Heather Gray sweater that says fun old fashioned family Christmas. It is the Griswolds and this sweater cracks me up because Clark didn't bring a saw to get to pull out his tree. And so when they're going back home, the whole roots and all is included. And I think it's hysterical that that's the image that they put on this sweater. I think you can actually choose different colors as well, but I picked gray. The next one is the shirt, which I wore in my recent Dollar Tree Christmas haul, which I'll link down below for you. Um, this shirt was $14.99 and it says, you serious Clark? Because this was like probably one of my favorite lines in the whole movie. And it's red. This is a size medium and they do have other colors as well. Okay, the next item I don't have because it hasn't arrived yet, but it is a TV stand with side doors and a barnwood finish. I finally have decided what I'm doing with this room that I have in front of my house. If you've seen some of my vlogs, then you know what room I'm talking about. It's supposed to be a formal dining room, but I don't really ever do formal dining rooms. I did decide to turn it into a reading room, and so now I'm moving forward and I'm gonna decorate for that. You will see a video on how I do it. So I got this TV stand for that room because I am gonna put a little TV in there and my books, and it's gonna be like a little, you know, comfy room. Okay, the next item, probably very boring to you guys, but in case you're interested, I got a coax cable splitter. So I thought, why don't I just move the cable box up there? But it just so happens that that's the same room that the cable guy put our internet into. And so I had to get the splitter so that I could feed the internet and the cable box. And when I called my company, they're like, oh, come to our store and pick up a splitter. And it was gonna be expensive. And I thought, I'm sure Amazon, that's how I think now. And I looked and it was like eight bucks and it came the very next day. So I didn't have to go anywhere. I didn't have to travel to their store and I got the splitter I needed and it worked great. All right, the next thing is a scarf. Now I just did a scarf collection video, but this scarf hasn't arrived yet. I'll insert a photo, it's $4.99. I got this specific scarf because I thought it would be perfect for jogging outside. It's gonna keep my neck nice and warm. Now I'll show you this again in case you didn't watch my scarf video, but the next three items I did get from Amazon and I talked about it in my scarf collection video, but I got this scarf, which was $11.98. It's an orange plaid, it's gorgeous. So if you wanna see my scarf collection, I'll link that video down below as well. And then I got this navy with this gorgeous lace trim. And then I got this like mustard yellow infinity scarf, which I'm obsessed with. And this one was $12.99 and this one was $11.99. Next item, I'm kind of disappointed in myself for not paying attention, so this is my tip to you. Make sure that if you're getting an item that's not considered prime, that you are looking to see where it's coming from and how long it's gonna take to get to you, because prime usually means you will get it within two days to three days, and even the same day, for free. So this item was not part of prime, but it is this, uh, mandala bohemian tapestry wall hanging indian wall art decor that my daughter wanted so this was very specific to what she wanted and it was only nine dollars and i still don't have it yet and i ordered it on october 2nd so it does say expected by november 15th so it's not like they're a bad seller it's just that i'm having to wait a really long almost a month and a half just to get this one $9 item when I probably could have researched for the same item and maybe found it from a like US based seller, someone closer and I could have gotten it sooner. The next thing is a cake stand. 
Um, I really just wanted like a clear cake stand and this one was $23. I probably just could have done better by going into any store, whether it was Michael's Hobby Lobby or Walmart and gotten a cheaper cake stand. So that was my fault, probably not the best deal, but I did want a clear cake stand. But this one's really interesting because it's like a six in one. It can be like a dip bowl, it can be um, like a cheese and cracker serving tray. You can turn it into a punch bowl. So it does all kinds of cool things. So essentially that's kind of worth the $23. The next four things that I got on Amazon are the Golden Girls DVD series. I'm not done. I've been kind of buying them here and there. They were about 13 bucks a piece. And I thought this was an amazing deal and they're brand new, so they're brand new. The next item is probably boring to a lot of people, but in the event that you lead a life similar to mine, um, this is probably one of my favorite things that I've purchased from Amazon, which is a edger and trimmer. And it's electric, so that's the fabulous part. You don't have to deal with putting the oil and gas because trimmers doesn't take, at least mine, the one I had before that was stolen, so if you remember my shed got broken into and my trimmer was one of the items that was stolen well i went on amazon and bought my trimmer which was like 80 bucks by black and decker and electric so i don't have to constantly spend money um, because i can charge my battery it actually is, is a dual purpose so and it works fantastic so easy for me to use and i also buy the line string trimmer so you do have to buy the the line and that's for any trimmer or edger you have to buy the line that cuts your grass I don't have to go anywhere i don't have to go to lowe's or home depot which i hate to do um and i just love the convenience of getting it through amazon the next thing and these are a lot of things that i've purchased for the game room and i've loved it because i found some really unique things um, but also really popular things. So I did buy the Spike Ball 3 Ball Game Set. The very first time I saw this was in Destin last year and I saw a couple people brought this game to the beach and they looked like they were having a fabulous time. So if I bought one for my daughter and her friends and they love it. The next thing that I got, I actually mentioned when I did a live video on my Instagram. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, I'll link it right here for you. I, sh I was doing kind of like my makeup while I was talking to you guys, and these are the brushes I was referring to. They are the BS Mall. I researched these on YouTube first. I wanted to see what cheap brushes were out there that were good quality, and I was surprised to find that they were from Amazon by a company called BS Mall. Yeah, I think I'm missing one like eyeshadow brush it's somewhere in my room. And I got the white set for myself, and then I got my daughter a black set, which I'll link a photo. And hers was $10.99, and she got $14. The next thing that I got is this knee ice pad. I may have mentioned it before. This was $11.99, one of my most favorite things that I've bought, because I didn't even know that these existed. I have a bad right knee, I have a bad IT band, and I like to ice my knee um, regularly and put heat on it as well, but I already have a heating pad. But my ice packs are like thick and when you put them in the freezer they're very rigid so it's hard to mold them when they're that iced over around your knee and when i saw that they had these and these just mold and i needed that ice on the sides also on the knee bandwagon i purchased these now these came in a set of two for twelve dollars the other one is in my room but this is um a patella knee strap and it provides pain relief for the patellar tendon support. It's an adjustable brace band for hiking, basketball, running, jumpers, knee, jumpers knee, volleyball, tendonitis, arthritis, and injury recovery. So I was using KT tape. Some of you may remember that if you watch all of my videos, but KT tape is expensive and it's not permanent. You use it once and that's it. You can only use it for that day and you have to throw it away. So they say it can last longer, but for me, I've noticed they really don't. They start to fray on the edges, and the moment they start to pick up off your skin, you got to pull them off because they will then come off. The next item, girl, let me tell you. Let me tell you. It is a Tile Mate Key Finder. $24 worth every penny because I've never even heard of anything like this, but my daughter lost her 
our first set of keys, the good ones, by the way, because our second set, because it's a used car, our second set was just worn out that we got from the dealership. And even though her car is an older model, it's like a 2012, those keys are not cheap. I can't even discuss how expensive they are, but the only fault of that is mine, right? That's, I can't blame her for it. It's my fault, but she lost her good set of keys on 4th of July and we did so much work in trying to find them. So much work. We went to the police station. <laughs> we s retraced her steps. We looked in the car that she was in with her friend. She wasn't even in her car, but her keys were with her. We went to the field because they were watching fireworks probably got chiggers from that. I was very itchy. We did so much. We went to the dealership to see if anyone like turned in keys. We did everything that we possibly could. So she stuck with her old crappy pair and, um, but I didn't want her to lose those. So I bought this tile mate and it's really cool because you download an app to it and it will track your keys for you if you lose them. So it's really awesome if you have a teenager driving or if you tend to lose your keys, this is gonna be perfect for you. It's awesome, I love it. The next thing is just a camera case bag. I bought a brand new camera and so I just wanted a case for it and it was $19.99. It's okay, I've noticed that it's not really built for a long lens and I do have a long lens so it doesn't really fit that great. So it's not the best camera bag, but I deal with it. The next item is something that I get asked all the time and I've, I've repeatedly said I got it on Amazon. So here you go. It is my blanket rack. It is a scroll three blanket rack, black with a bronze rub finish. And it was $28. So I'll insert a photo here so that you can see what it looks like. And I absolutely- This item is this upholstered bench. And I love this because these benches can go for over $100. And I got mine for $79. And it's very cute. It sits at the end of my daughter's hallway. Um, it's a gray bench, so it matches perfect with her room colors. And it was $79. All right, guys, that is my haul. I'm gonna go ahead and end this video because I feel like I've talked your ear out. I hope that you enjoyed it. I will again link everything down below for you. Don't forget to go through eBay to save yourself that money. And I hope that you guys enjoy your online shopping as much as I do because there's nothing better than not wasting gas, having it delivered straight to my door, and it's easy to return. They pay for it if you have Prime. So yeah, so I hope that you enjoyed this and found this video also informational, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.